Hi everyone, it's Miss Megan, and today we're going to learn how to make a catapult or a launcher. Um, so stay tuned for what materials you'll need. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need is a ruler. Um, I'm using a ruler, but you can use a meter stick if you have a meter stick at home. You're also going to need two rubber bands. You're going to need a cap from some kind of bottle. Um, so this is just a cap that I had found from something that we were recycling. You can also use a water bottle cap um, or a soda cap. So anything that you guys are recycling, um, definitely use the cap from that. Don't take it off of a bottle that currently has liquid in it. You're also going to need a piece of tape rolled up. So I just took a piece of pink tape um, and then I rolled it up. You're also going to need something round. So you can use a coffee container, you can use um, a water bottle. I used a salt shaker, so this has salt in it. Um, it currently has salt in it, so if you're using something that has some kind of ingredient in it, just make sure that it's closed up really tight. Um, I had to make sure that no salt was gonna spill out when I was using it. Um, but preferably try to use something that is empty. And then you're also going to need something to launch. So I chose an eraser cap. Try to choose something that isn't going to do damage to your walls or your floor. So an eraser cap is a really good idea because it's really light um, and it's squishy so it won't do any harm. You can also use pom-poms. Um, so look around your house, see if there's anything. Maybe you guys have little tiny like foam balls um, from other games or anything like that that you can launch. Um, and here's the next steps. Okay, so you're going to take your tape and your cap and you're going to put the tape on the bottom of the cap just like this, okay? And then you're going to take your ruler and you're going to place the cap at the end of the ruler. Now, if you guys don't have any caps at home, I've also seen this done with cups. Um, so you might have to use a little bit more tape for a cup. And um, it'll look like this at the end, just like this, okay? And the next step is going to be with the rubber bands. So you're going to need your rubber bands, you're going to need your round container, so I'm using my salt container, and you'll need your ruler. Okay, this next step is a little bit tricky, so you might need an adult to help you, but you're going to take your first rubber band, your round container, and your ruler, and you're just going to balance it on top of your round container like this. And then what you're going to do is you're going to attach your rubber band to both the ruler and to your round container. Now, when you do this, it's going to end up looking like this, okay? So the first rubber band is gonna be the easiest one because it's going to look like this. However, we want our catapult to be this way. So it's gonna look kind of like a T. So to do that, we're going to take our second rubber band and we're going to put it on in the opposite direction. So as you can see, when you turn it, it makes a diagonal line so we want our next rubber band to make a diagonal line in the other direction. So I'm going to put it on from the other direction. So I didn't put it on from this way the first time. So we're going to go like this and then we're going to double it. And if it's too far away, you can adjust this because you can move it back. And then you'll put it around this again. just like that, okay? Because you want to have, it ends up looking like an X, like this. So your rubber bands should look like an X. And that's pretty much all it is. It was super simple. Um, and then you just need your eraser cap or whatever you're launching. Remember, make sure it's not something that's gonna do any damage to your house. So it should be something squishy um, and soft. Um, but just remember the lighter weight that it is, 
the less far that it'll go. So an eraser cap is actually a pretty good weight. Um, it goes pretty far down the hallway. And you're just gonna put that in your cap like this. When you put it on the floor, you're going to want this part to be flat on the floor like this, okay? And then when you launch it, you're going to use your hand and you're going to push down. Let's see if I can do this. There we go. You're going to push down on this side really hard and it's going to fling your eraser cap or whatever you're launching all the way down the hallway. You can also do this outside. Um, if you guys have acorns in your lawn, you can do it outside and use acorns. It's really fun. Um, if you have somebody that at home that can also do this with you, maybe they can make a second one and you can see how far each of them go um, and then have a little competition. And I hope everybody has a lot of fun. Bye.